happy days really is where all of scouting lies. And for us, it's very important, and we believe being in Kenya is important for us, because Nyeri is where the founder of scouting is. You can go to Girwell Park in London, but they will tell you the one who started everything is here. So we don't need to go somewhere else to look for scouting than coming to Kenya and coming to Africa. So we are very proud of being here. The second thing I would like to mention is that this year, for the first time, the current Secretary General of the movement came to Kenya. And when he came to Kenya, we definitely visited a number of projects. And we went to Kibera. We took a picture with the scout in Kibera. And I'll tell you that that picture feature in all of our magazine, on our website, and that picture put Kenya in front of the world. Still during that visit, he also learned about the good term, and in scouts we talked about good term, isn't it? And he also learned about the good term that scouts in Kenya do. And one of them is planting trees. After Kenya, he was invited in New York to speak in front of the whole world. And he showcased Kenya as an example of good citizenship. So Kenya, again, kudos and congratulations for what you are doing for us. And lastly, this year, Kenya Scout Association turned a media. And Kenya Scout Association has become the sixth biggest national scout organization in the world. And I believe it is a reason for us to be very proud of Kenya Scout Association. And as I stand here, I also try to renew the commitment of the World Organization of Scout Movement and the World Scout Bureau to continue working closely with Kenya Scout Association so that we can take scouts in Kenya forward and use Kenya as a model for other national scout organizations within Africa and within the world. This year also, last month, on the 6th of October, we received as a movement an award for leadership in the world, and again, for protection of the environment. And I would like to say that if you have not heard about that, that certificate is given not to the World Scout Organization, but to each and every scout and scout leaders. It is on our website. You can print it, put your name, and be proud of putting it anywhere that you like to show that you are a scout and that you are contributing to the protection of the world. Africa Scout Region has got 38 National Scout Association plus nine potential members. And we believe that for a long time we have been working closely with Kenya Scout Association and we see kind of this program that we are doing, like this competition, which in, apart from Southern Africa is not yet well developed in other zones. By the way, we have got five zones in Africa and most likely we get Kenya Scout Association as a lighthouse. My last word should be to the participant to the competition. And I would like to borrow from the young lady who actually presented the feeling of the participant to the competition. And she said something very important to me. I remember again the first time I did my first camping and there was also part of the competition as a scout. The turn of that we asked what was so important for you. And I remember by that time I was a very good player. I was dying to be number one, but I came number seven. <laughs> and when I was asked, then my teacher told me, I was crying at them. My teacher told me, the most important thing is not the prize that you get from the competition but the lessons that we learn. And I believe part of those competitions are what made me to be today standing in front of you as regional director for Africa. I believe if I had won by that time, maybe I would not have been here. And I would like to pass this message to all of you. 
either you won the prize or not, I think the most important thing is the lessons that we have learned. And in scouting, our motto is to make the world a better place. And we like to have many of you who have learned from this competition to go back to your school, to go back to your communities, to go back to your homes and implement these lessons so that we can be proud of them. I would like to remind all of us the importance of investing in the youth but more so the importance of investing in scouting. Because scouting as a value-based education system, we are forming characters. We know all the vices that our society is going through. And we cannot change an impact in this society if we don't form young people of characters. And I believe that's the most important contribution of scouting.